11 minutes. As you all know, we got to do some things differently this year. Instead of the large 20,000 in-person crowds we are accustomed to, this year we isolated our athletes in a bubble. After three long, grueling days of competition by 100 different competitors from 10 different countries, we have narrowed down our field to the two finest service professionals on planet Earth. Introducing Josh Wilcox, hailing from the great state of Oklahoma. Josh enjoys the only soaps in his free time and his Alpaca Ranch. Our next competitor is an unapologetic Wisconsin native who enjoys bird watching at night and is internationally prepared accordion player. Meet Charlie Whiteford. Now that we know our competitors a little better, it's time to talk about our main event, the dreaded obstacle course. In this event, Josh and Charlie will be carrying a full tray to a table where three athletes will be awaiting them. Both elite athletes will proceed to fold the three styles of napkin folds we utilize at the University Club. After they have successfully folded their three napkins, they will then move behind the bar and launch into the beverage pouring events. Our competitors will need to open a bottle of wine and while shaking a martini, pour three ounces of wine into a glass. Once the wine has successfully been poured, they then have to pour the martini into a carafe without spilling. Next, they will head to the library to answer some of the most riveting food beverage trivia questions. This competition clearly summons these contestants to utilize all facets of their mind, body, and spirit. We will conclude by having Charlie and Josh carry a tray of drinks without spilling much through the gauntlet and into the kitchen. The competitor who gets to the dish pit in the least amount of time and with the fewest mistakes will be crowned our new champion, while the loser will be dressing up as Santa Claus to hand out employee bonuses and Christmas care packages. First up, Charlie Pfeiffer. On your marks, get set, go! Didn't get all of it. Oh boy, it's gonna cost me. Alright, what are the six key ingredients that compose a Miswa? Miswa salad. Um, 
green beans, potatoes, salmon, uh, greens, and I don't know, I don't know, pass. Okay, which country has the largest area of vineyards? France. What comes in a Gibson? In a Gibson, it's a cocktail onion and gin. Mark it. Someone was uh, fiddling with it, and okay. you don't gotta blame it on someone else, of course. We have but. cameras back there, so we will be taking a look. If we need to, uh, we might have to recall this. Okay. Thanks a lot, Bruce. Next competitor, Joshua Wilcox. On your mark. Get set, go. greens of some sort, tuna, uh, seared tuna, potatoes, green beans, hard boiled egg, tomatoes. You actually missed it, it's anchovies. Oh. So next one, what country has the largest area of vineyards? Um, Italy. Nope. What comes in a Gibson? Ooh, gin and an olive, no, an onion. And, and vermouth. stuck so you know things to learn okay what was the uh, the most challenging aspect of what was the easy breezy part for you 
Uh, staying dry was the most difficult. Uh, tuna knee swats question, also difficult. The cork, also difficult. All around, pretty difficult. No easy breezy out there. It's a very challenging obstacle course, folks, and uh, we are tallying up the results. At this point, it is too close to call. We'll be back with you for the official results. Thanks, folks. And in second place of our 2020 Obstacle Course Challenge and 2020 Santa Claus, it is Josh Wilcox. Ho, ho, ho. Congratulations on second place, Josh. Thanks so much. It's really drying up my clothes in front of here. Which means... Out of Mina, Wisconsin, putting Mina on the map is Charlie Pfeiffer, this year's obstacle course champion. Thanks for all the competitors for showing up and uh, having a good time out there. Uh, I'm really looking forward to repeating next year. Thank you, thank you. The challenge is on. See you all next year. Happy holidays.